so today we're going to do another part of what was going to be in the workshop. Uh, it's called catch and throw. Um, it's used for catching a sheep for shearing or to check its mouth or check for flies or any other things. Um, it's a good way to hold a sheep um, so it's not stressed and you're not under a lot of pressure. So first we've got to catch the sheep. So you put them up in the corner. You want a small pen, punch them all up. See how they naturally just go in the corner. So you want to grab this one, get its head, get its head, turn it round towards its body. Now I've got my right knee in its in towards its back, and I'm putting pressure with my right hand. And then I just step back, and then I can pull it up. All right. And now he's sitting there. Now he's sitting there. Um, you know, pretty comfortable. That means he's relaxed when he's got his head down like that. And um, I'm sort of holding him, he's cradled in between my feet and my knees. And from here, I can check like he's a weather, I can check for, for any flies, or flies in his crutch. He's been crutched recently. Can do their feet, check their feet. And another really good thing is to check their teeth. Um, checking their teeth is a good, it's good if you're buying sheep, you know how old they are or if they're really old, you know, if they are past it or not. So yeah, another thing is check their, the skin in their eyes. Um, it, how pink it is tells you if they're anemic, if they've got worms. So that's a good indicator. He's, he's looking pretty healthy. All right. And he can do anything with them. Like that's what you do when you're shearing him. And then you just let them go.